Philadelphia Flyers hosting the Detroit Red Wings. And now, this is the night before these lines literally just came out, so they're going to change a little bit. Now, the Red Wings are minus 115 on the money line. The Flyers are minus 105. The over-under is six goals. The Red Wings getting a goal and a half are minus 270. The Flyers laying a goal and a half are plus 215. Now, the Red Wings are 4-6 and six in their past 10, and in the games where they were an underdog and could not lose by two, if you bet them that way, they're 1-4. and four. The Flyers are on a two-game winning streak. They're 2-8 and eight in their past 10. In the games where they were a favorite, yes, they were a favorite in two games. They are 0-2 oh if you bet them as a favorite to win by two goals. Head-to-head, -head, the Flyers are on a five-game winning streak against the Red Wings. They are 8-2 and two against the Red Wings in their past 10. The favorite is 7-3 and three when these teams match up against each other. The favorite is on a five-game winning streak. The under is 2-1. and one. The last... Three games that they've played have been decided by two or more goals, but seven out of the ten games that they've played between each other in the past ten have been decided by one. So there's some fun, like, misinformation there. I'm going to take the Flyers with the money line, the Red Wings with the goal and a half, and the under, and we'll see if I'm right or if I'm wrong.